Hey, my name is Rowan Smith, and I want to welcome you to the Training for Trekking podcast. Now, this is the world's very first podcast, which is entirely dedicated to helping you train, prepare, and conquer your upcoming hike, trek, or mountain adventure. So once a week, I'm going to be giving you quality and practical information on the subjects of physical preparation for trekking, dealing with attitude, and nutrition on the trail, so you can know everything you need to be doing to have the best chance of a safe, enjoyable, and successful adventure. So now you know what you're in for, let's get into today's episode. All right, hello, hello, guys. Today, I want to do a really quick episode around supplements for hikers. Now, the other day, I got in a conversation with a friend, and we were talking about supplements in regards to the fitness industry and training, and we were talking about supplements when it comes to hikers themselves. Now, exercise uh, nutrition supplements, you know, it's a massive, 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 massive industry. There's a million and one different supplements out there. There's so much money. There's a lot of claims. There's a lot of confusion, and there's a lot of people taking a lot of supplements. And so I was curious because it's not something I haven't really talked about in a while. So I put out a question out to my email list of the subscribers to the Summit Strength newsletter and basically asking them, you know what, as a hiker, do you take any supplements to help either your training or your hiking? And I was just curious about, you know, what people are actually doing and people who are following me and, you know, what you're putting your money into, what you're putting your body in. There was no right or wrong answer to that because it's a massive subject and everyone's got their own reasons for doing things. But I was just genuinely curious about what people were taking. And I got a lot of responses back when some people, you know, going for ranging from some people taking absolutely nothing to some people who are taking dozens and dozens every single day. Um, and it was very, very interesting to see the spread of it all. But one recurring question I got from people was whether they were taking none or one or a few or multiple. Lots of people said they didn't really know whether these things were working and they didn't really know whether these things would, you know, actually backed up to the claims that they saw when they bought the, bought the supplement. They didn't really know when they see recommendations online in a fight hiking Facebook group from friends, from family members or whatever, they didn't really know who to trust. And they didn't know how to get clear answers on this. And there was a lot of confusion and a lot, a little bit of frustration I could see coming through these emails. Because as I said, it is a massive industry. There's so much money going around. There's so much marketing hype going around. And it can be very confusing to know, is this worth spending my money on? Is this actually going to help me? And is this relevant to the things that I'm trying to improve on? So today, I just want to give you a really, really clear answer to this. Regardless of what type of supplement you're considering, regardless of what type of supplement you're thinking about buying, regardless of what you're taking, if you want a clear answer to what is going on, what the evidence, what the science, what the research shows for each supplement, and actually whether there's a lot of proof, whether there's a little bit of proof, whether there's absolutely no proof or whatever it may be, if you're curious about any type of supplement, I highly, highly encourage all the hikers listening to this to the, go to the website examine.com. That's E-X-A-M-I-N-E dot com. Now, this is an absolutely fantastic resource, which I use myself when I come across things I don't know, which I recommend to my clients and I've used for many, many years. That is an absolutely fantastic resource in which you can go into this website, you can plug in whatever the supplement is, not the brand name, but the actual thing you're taking, and it will come up with a really, really, really thorough rundown of all the claims, what it's supposed to do, what it actually does. If you love your science, it tells you how it does it, and it gets a little like quite detailed there. But it also breaks down all the different claims and all the actual evidence behind it. So it'll say, for example, you know, let's say caffeine. And then caffeine has a billion and billion and billion claim benefits saying, you know, it'll improve your performance, it'll improve your mood, it'll extend your life, and yada, yada, yada. And next to every single claim that there is out there, which there's research about, they'll say, look, there's strong proof to say this is a strong benefit, or there's minimal proof to say there might be a slight benefit, or there's a lot of proof to show there's no benefit. And it gives you a really, really clear insight. So if you're a hiker and either you're considering a supplement or you're taking a lot of supplements, or you're just curious about anything that someone's been talking about. I highly encourage you to go to that website, examine.com, plug it in. 99% of the time you will get an answer and that is one resource I absolutely trust and I'd highly recommend you get around it. So 
hopefully that helps a few people out who may be in a similar position because I know it can be a very, very confusing subject. And me sitting here all day talking through every single supplement under the sun, it's not going to do any benefit. But hopefully that resource really will help you out. So if you do need help with that, check out examine.com or alternatively, if you're curious, you can always shoot me an email, shoot me a message and I'll do the research for you um, and shoot me a message, say what you're taking. I can go suss it out and I can send you a few screenshots or whatever of what the available evidence is. So that's my offer to you if you are feeling a little bit lazy. So hope you've enjoyed the episode today, guys. Hope you get to use this and put it into action and get some value out of it because it is an incredible resource and it's definitely something that can save you a lot of grief, a lot of drama and a lot of money over the long term. So thanks for listening and we'll talk to you soon. Bye.